This is another subscriber request. Andy, thank you for sending me this puzzle. I'm slowly getting to requests that have backed up, so if you've sent me a request in the last few months, hopefully I'll get to it here pretty soon. We used some advanced techniques to solve this puzzle. At one point we need to use two techniques together, and I'll show you where that is. Then later on it uh, uh, gets a little tricky again. I'd say this puzzle is uh, has a skill level of hard. It's not expert or diabolical, but it's fairly tricky. We'll start by putting a 9 here. 999. Nine, nine. And then we've got a 444. Four, four. Four, 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 four there. And we're, we're already kind of in trouble here. If you go through uh, this puzzle, you probably notice that there's nothing uh, real obvious at this point. But if we look at row five, we'll find some triplets and not even that will get us past it, but we'll find, use another technique in combination with these triplets here in order to uh, find some numbers on this row and get us going again. So let's see what we're missing. One, two, six, eight, nine. We're missing one, two, six, eight, and nine. Here's a six, eight, nine, so that's a one or a two. Here's a 289, so that's a 1 or a 6. Here's a 189, so that's a 2 or a 6. So 1, 2, 1, 6, 2, 6. So these are 8, 9 twins here. Okay, so we found these 1, 2, 6 triplets and these 8, 9 twins, but we still can't solve anything, so we're going to have to look a little more. Okay, then I noticed that we've got a 1 here and ghost 1's here because of this wall pattern right there. So the 1 has to be there or there. So 1, ghost 1's 1. And we've got a 1 here, 1. And so 1, 1, with those 1's in those two boxes there, eliminates these two rows for this section. So the one in box four has is constrained to row four here. Okay, and what did we have here? One, two, one, six, two, six. So that can't be a one because it's the one's constrained to one of these two, three cells here. So that's got to be a two. All right, and then we have one, six, two, six. So that's got to be a six because there's a two there already. And that makes that a one. All right, now we've got two, three, and five here left in this box. We've got a two and a five there. All right, and now and here's something that I look for quite often. Here are 6 and 7 and 6 and 7. So that means 6 and 7 have to go here. So we have 6, 7 twins there. And with 6, 7 twins there, we've got a hidden loner cell right here. If you're not familiar with uh, some of these patterns I'm talking about or these techniques like loner cells, Go to sudokuprimer.com. There's a write-up about all the, a lot of the patterns and techniques that I use on these uh, puzzles. So we have six, seven twins there. That makes that a hidden loner cell. And what do we have here? Four, six, seven, eight. So four, six, seven. So that's got to be an eight. That makes that a nine. All right, and then we got a six and seven here we can finish this column with. With that six, 
It makes that a 7 and that a 6. Finishes that column. All right, now let's look at box 2 here. 6, 6, 6. And you notice we had 4, 4, 4. And before we put that 6 in there, 4, 4, 4. So that can't be a 4, so that's a 4. And that makes that a 4 right there. And then uh, we've got a gate pattern here with a 9 going through the gate. And there's a 9 here, so that's a 9 right there. And again, um, if, you've, uh, if you're not familiar with these patterns or techniques, there's a whole section on patterns on sudokuprimer.com. All right, and now we've got a 7 and 7 there and a 7 there, so that makes that a 7. All right, now let's look at row 3 here. What are we missing? 3, 5, 8. 3, 5, and 8. Well, there's a 3 and an 8, so that's a 5. That leaves 3 and 8 here, and there's an 8 there, so that's a 3, and that's an 8. All right, and now we've got a 5, 5, and a 5 there. That puts a 5 right there. And our two, let's see, we only had 2 and 5 left here. We've got 5, 8 twins there. So that makes ghost 5s there. That's got to be the 2 then. And a 5 right there. There's only one number left here. That's a 2. All right. And now, uh, remember how I saw these 6, 7s here, 6, 7s here? So these are six sevens. Now we have a one seven there, one seven there. So these are one sevens. That leaves two and three there. There's a three there, so we can fill in the two and the three. We can't solve the one sevens yet. All right. And with with this, we've put that three in there. With that three and that three, we've got a three there. All right, and now let's see, we got a two, two, two. So that's a two right there. Now we got two, two, two there. So that's a two and two, two, two there because of that two. This is a five. We got a five, five, and so that's a five right there. All right. Okay, so we have one eight. Let's just look and see what we've got left here. We got five eight twins there. Uh, three five eight there. One seven there. One nine there. Six seven there. One eight there. All right. Okay. Now. Um, Let's see, we're missing 3, 5, and 8 here. Got a 3 there, a 3 there, and a 3 there, so that's a 3. 3, 3, 3's, and there's a 3 there, so we can put a 3 there. And 3, 3, so that's a 3 right there. Now we're missing 1, 6, 1 and 6 there, 1 and 6 there, 5 and 8, 5 and 8, 1, 7. One nine six seven one eight. All right. Let's see what we can do now. All right. Now let's look at column four right here. We're only missing six and eight. We've got an eight there, so we can solve those easily. All right. Now. We've got a 9 here and a 9 here. So we've got 9, 9, 9. And there's a 9 there already. So you can put the 9 in. Now we're missing 1 and 5 here. So we can put those in. All right, now we got 
Now we can solve the 1 8 twins there, because that one. And the 5 8 twins there, because of that 8. And the 5 8 twins there. And the 1 6 twins there, because of that 6. All right, that leaves a 1 here, the only number left in this column. Um, let's see. Now we're missing one and seven here. We have one seven twins there and one seven there. With that one, we can complete that and the seven there, seven, one, and seven. And now we've got six and nine there, six and seven. 1, 9. With that 7, we can solve the 6 and 7. With that 1, we can solve the 1 and the 9. And we have 6 and 9 there. 9 and 6. And we're done. All right. So there you have it. Um, not too difficult a puzzle, but got a little tricky in spots. So uh, it was kind of fun to solve. Well, thank you for watching, and thank you, Andy, thank you for your request, and I'll see you on the next video.